I don't need your help. I could do it myself. Can you? The contracting guy takes 75. Greetings and welcome to The Contracting Guy. I am The Contracting Guy. And today I want to talk to you about going it alone or doing it yourself. There are plenty of folks out there that like to be the, the lone wolf, want to do this, uh, getting involved with this federal co uh, contracting all by themselves. But, you know, for the most of us, we kind of like to have someone to go along with. I mean, a little guide or someone to hold our hands, someone to be able to tell us that, yeah, that's good, or or perhaps not, you know, you need to do that again. There are many organizations out there that can do this. Now, a couple that come to mind are the PTACs or Procurement Technical Assistance Centers. They're located across the country. And they're there to support you in your small business endeavor. Now, they do have a Department of Defense focus because they're funded by DLA, but they help anyone who's interested and have a kind heart. Another organization that is veteran focused is the VBOCs. They're sponsored not by the Department of Defense, but they're sponsored by the Small Business Administration, the SBA. Now, they do a very similar job to that of the PTAX, and uh, I suggest that if you're a veteran-owned small business, they do focus on those guys. So a veteran-owned small business, a service-disabled veteran-owned small business, if you're in that arena, look to them because they will provide help. But frankly, the PTAX will help you as well. So don't cut yourself short. Make as many... Uh, contacts as possible. Another group that isn't there to help you get involved in government contracting, but they are to help you get insight into uh, government opportunities. And these people are, uh, each agency has what's called the uh, OSDABU, or the Office of Small and Disadvantaged Business Utilization. These are like the small business reps at each agency. Those guys are there to help you too. Another group, and I mentioned that a little bit earlier, the Small Business Administration, they have a variety of resources as well to help out small businesses. Hence the name Small Business Administration, probably a key point there. So there are a number of organizations that will do this. Now, there is another place that you can look. Again, these are all you should look at. This one is the at LinkedIn. Now, LinkedIn has groups. And you can join a group to learn some more information about what you're doing. Uh, there are some great advisory notes that are uh, published in LinkedIn that, are co that come from a, a variety of different consultants. And these guys are in the business of helping small business and helping business in general do better. So uh, you should look at uh, LinkedIn. Uh, for example, uh, if you take a look at uh, Eileen uh, uh, Kent, Eileen Kent. Sorry, Eileen, if I just sort of blew that one. Eileen Kent, you could look at uh, Gavology. You could look at uh, Coprints. You could look at Center Consulting. You could look at uh, a variety of different uh, consultants out there. And most of the information they're providing is, is good, sound contracting information and good focus for small businesses. And these are the ones that you kind of grab onto and sort of listen to them. Now, I would say, this is sort of the Jim Phillips contracting guy focus on you. Don't settle with one person or one organization. Get a variety of perspectives. Listen to everyone. Ask questions. Those things are very helpful um, you know, as you start modeling your practice to what you're going to do, because you're going to start out thinking, well, I want to do this. And you might find out you can't do that the way you think you can. 
So these people can help you out. So remember the PTEX, the VBOCs, SBA, uh, the Osdebu folks, the consultants you see on LinkedIn, all of these people are there to help you get ahead. And if you don't use them, you're going to cut yourself short. So this is the contracting guy. I'm out. Thank you for watching the contracting guy. Please like, subscribe, and share the video. We'd appreciate that. This is the contracting guy. I'm out.